Monday, everyone. Um, last week of October, what the heck? Things are flying by. Life is flying by. And things that are on my calendar, if you didn't catch our reels last night, um, my sweater reels, we're having another baby, which is really exciting. So today we strategically styled me in the tightest dress and so that we can show the bump. But um, love handles feel to be growing just as fast as this baby bump. So then I was like, we got to throw a jacket over the top of it. But I will say, if you are shopping for maternity, this is the best dress ever. But I want to say thank you to everybody with all the well wishes and congratulations and all the excitement around the baby. We're excited. We're due next February, um, which is coming up way too fast. So thanks for all the love. And yeah, I'm going to continue to do stories and live for as far as I can clothes get a little tricky and tight, or maybe they already have. So um, I'll be sprinkled in throughout the rest of um, my pregnancy, but um, I for sure am going to join Monday mornings with you guys. So that's kind of some fun news to kick off your Monday. But last week of the month, it's getting crazy. It's getting real cold. And we got the most cozy new arrivals hitting right now. So we're going to be talking about that. But let's talk about my outfit first, because this just feels like the best basic Monday morning when you don't know what to wear this is what you could be wearing and it never gets old right never never ever gets old so I'm wearing the Michael stars the rib square neck dress this is like our best-selling dress that we have in like every single uh, every season it's got a little rib knit love this like modernized little um, square v-neck throwing it a little slit on the side to get a little sexiness to it um, Oh no, it's supposed to be at work when my street is flooded. I'm so sorry. Shoot, Michigan, you're getting a lot of rain right now. It is crisp, cool fall out here. So I'm like, oh, I feel for you. Um, and then I threw over this little blank NYC, this new, or no, this is Pistola, you guys. This is the Elsa jacket. How could I forget? Elsa is a very fan favorite at our house. Um, the little Elsa denim jacket. I love it that it's a little bit more oversized. And then these amazing little Dolce Vita suede boots, which just feel so much fall and feels so, so good. So that's a little bit about what I'm wearing. And then let's dig into all the new arrivals. We are going to start with a little item that we have been waiting forever to come in and it finally hit probably one of my favorite jackets. You Have you seen this for the last two months? Because it finally came and it was in our September book, the Ray plaid jacket. But in, look at these like amazing neutral colors, you guys. So, so cute. I'm like, how adorable would this be over this dress? these boots you're set to go a little bit lighter weight but it finally hit grab it now because it's already moving fast the waiting list in our stores have been hot 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 so this is finally in crew and i would buy true to size in the ray jacket okay more new goodies that just hit check out these new sweaters from french connection i was like this is reading holiday so hardcore but i'm here for it and this is one of our best selling sweaters we've had year after year this is the high neck balloon pullover so you get this great little like mock neck neckline but then this sleeve just has a touch of detail with that little bit of a balloon sleeve but just a great basic always to have in your wardrobe comes in this like creamy white and this bright bold red it's just like when in doubt toss this on and then you're set to go throw it on yes I will pull the I will put the jacket on it's so cute but how cute actually would this be together when it's getting real cozy I mean we're hitting 40 degrees here so that's real cool the double layer needs to happen but how cute is that little situation with the jacket so you guys this French pullover French connection pullover we've had I think for three years every year it sells to the piece it's so so good just an easy little mock neck um, Oh shoot, I think my microphone might pop off, just FYI, or I'm connected, so I can't. Sorry, we're really fancy with our microphones. I can't throw on this jacket because I got it like half connected to my jacket, half connected to this dress, so fly. I'm not going to throw the jacket on, the jacket on, but make note of that the next time. Microphones and dresses, like, and you don't have pockets, where do you put all these things? Okay, another little mock neck pullover. This one by Evereve, such a pretty little mocha color. The Moira... I cannot say Myra without saying it in a Schitt's Creek voice. Um, turtleneck pullover, the color is cocoa. How cute is this? This seems just like an easy little cotton um, pullover. So easy. Again, do that with a pair of jeans or actually a little, it would be really cute with a pair of like destructed black jeans. And then these brown boots, just a really 
um, cozy neutral vibe for fall but this just hit and I'm all about the mock neck pullover because um, then you don't need to fuss with like do I leave the turtleneck undone? Do I roll it? What do I do with it? It's just all set to go here. Here's the back of the jacket, which just has this like, let's see the microphone there, guys, sorry. This like little vibe hint to the 80s, I think, but I love it because it just creates a little bit of shape instead of just going all the way down. So, so, so cute. What size of the dress I'm wearing? I am wearing a medium, I think. Um, I own this in a medium, so, um, so easy. Has a lot of ruching give, so comfortable absolutely love it and what I love about this dress too and I don't even know if you can see it on camera here because I feel like this light but you have all this ruching so if you carry your weight in your butt your hips your tummy wherever you just I use the ruching to kind of like hide and disguise everything and then throw a jacket or a little vest over the top and you're totally set to go and I love this dress because I think any body type you think about anybody on our style crew can totally rock this dress which makes it the most magical thing on earth so okay talking about some of our favorite denim that just hit from cut from the cloth i can't tell you how much i'm obsessed with this wash this must be the high rise connie ankle skinny with exposed buttons so check out these fun little exposed buttons so cute with actually this would be really adorable little mock neck sweater give it a half tuck to show off those buttons these cute little tan boots but look at how pretty this wash is I just love that it's a little bit darker, but it's still clean, but has a lot of variation to it. It just looks so yummy. And then love that the buttons are just like in this little matted silver. Question. Oh, our jewelry. So I just had this like two for one necklace on basic, basic chains. Check out these fun little earrings that are kind of like dangly, but casual. I don't know, kind of, I don't, it just feels so dressy, but not stretchy, dressy but not dressy. I don't know, I'm totally into it. Our jewelry right now is super fun. And then if you had like little pendants, you could throw on the pendant with it. So that's a little bit about my jewelry jam. And the dress is by, the question is who's the dress by? The dress is by Michael Stars. So winner, winner, chicken dinner, always with a Michael Stars dress. So good. Okay, so these are cut from the cloth, brand new. What I, if you haven't invested in cut either, I think what's really fun is it has such great value. Typically under $100 price point, um, you buy true to size or can size down a little bit. Just a really great denim without completely breaking the bank. So super fun, new Connie high rise. So, so, so obsessed with this wash. Okay, this guy came in next to, this is the Reese high rise straight. That Reese is that really beautiful silhouette that's in between a straight leg and a boyfriend, I kind of think, or like the modernized boyfriend and just like a really easy straight leg. So it just has this cool modern look. Um, typically a little bit more of a mid rise, less of a high rise, but this again, as the temps start to dip, I know we want to do less destruction because you don't have to worry about like, this is the weirdest thing ever, your knees freezing or everywhere else. So just a clean, easy wash is so good to go, but I love the little highs and lows in this because you get the idea of destruction without actually having holes. Um, my favorite denim brand, we got a comment here, my favorite denim brand always fits great. Agreed. Cut is so consistent, fits beautifully, just such a great denim. And then you have a little raw hem here. So again, petite, if you want to cut it off a little bit, you're good to go. I think what's so fun about the Reese, because it's that like a little bit more of a true straight leg, if you wanted to do a cuff, depending on what footwear, you totally can rock that. It's really simple, super easy, and really good to go. Reese is my fave cut. Reese is my favorite cut too. I love the um, fit of a Reese from Cut. I just think it feels really modern and fresh. Okay, and if you're really tiptoeing into those cold temps, check out, I don't know why I love these, but I so love these because number one, I love a beanie because number one, when you're growing out bangs, you never know what's gonna happen with your hair. Number two, you look pulled together without actually having to do anything to your hair because sometimes I can be real lazy, but check out these fun new beanies by Everive. How fun is this? So I don't know if you guys can tell this color. This is like a really bright, beautiful pink. You think about that really obnoxious lipstick that maybe you bought in the 90s that my mom was like, where did you get that for $2 at the drugstore? I don't know, that's what you got, but it, now it's in a beanie. I'm like, how cute is that? How cute is it with this whole look if you're like, pop outside, set to go. But I'm just comparing it next to the red just so you can see how pink it is. So, so fun. I've tried these on, they feel snug. So I don't know if you 
Does anybody else feel this passion about beanies? Maybe just me, but like I feel really passionate about how it feels on your head. You don't want it too loose. You don't want it too tight so you get a headache, but they just feel snug. They're gonna stay put, stay, stay put, so good to go, but you have this like beautiful pink, this beautiful cocoa, love a good classic cream, and then classic back, black. But I was like, talk about your little transitional outfit or accessories for fall. How cute are these little combos? So you can do this new little Ray jacket and then pair it back to one of our new Every beanies. So, so cute. And then the other thing I wanna show you guys on this, check out the little leather marking right here with our With Heart. Like, how cute is that? Just feels so cute. Yes, Britt. Two questions. Yeah. Can you go over the name of the jeans again? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Um, I don't know, maybe it would be two and a half inches. They're like a rubble, rubber sole and they have a ton of like thickness to them. So it feels sturdy, but definitely makes me feel a little bit sexier lengthening the leg. And when you're five months pregnant and everything feels very aggressive and full, it just feels good to feel just a touch sexier and taller. So you feel a little bit more <laughs> balanced out here through everything. Um, okay, back to the cut jeans. So you guys, this is the Connie High Rise. This is probably one of our best-selling silhouettes from Cut. Such a great skinny jean. Loving this exposed button. I just think this whole um, denim looks modern, forward. Absolutely obsessed with the wash, which is called, let me get that for you, Legacy. So, 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 so pretty. And then it's like this really bright stitching. Just gives it a touch of like 70s vibe. And then this is the Reese from Cut. This is the Reese High Rise Straight and the color is Promote. So it's this really pretty washed, um, um, clean Reese, but so good. So you don't have to go destructive, just could still get the vibe from the wash. Are the beanies satin lined? The beanies are not satin lined. Like think of these, the like it's the same knit fabric on the outside and the inside, but they're incredibly, I don't want to use the term thick. They just feel strong and just like great quality of a beanie so so cute and obsessed with these what brand are the boots the brand of the boots are dolce vita you guys and then this beanie is called the lena beanie and it's under 30 they're all one size so and i have an extremely large head um and these feel really good so okay the question is does cut make a good straight leg yes it's called the reef straight which is awesome right here this is the straight leg you need to invest in. So if you're looking for a straight leg from cut, you're going to buy the Reese. Hands down, best silhouette. We have it in a ton of different washes, fits a lot of body types. So, so good. So this is, if you're looking for a straight leg from cut, the Reese is your gal. Okay. Which brand are those boots? Again, these are Dolce Vita. I might've already answered that question, but really great segue into my other favorite boots. Check out the new goodies that just hit from Sorrel. Okay, so we had a version like these last year. This is their combat boot. You guys, this is their weatherproof combat boot. But check out this Everive exclusive in the all black. I'm kind of absolutely obsessed with these. And this black suede, have these. These are like this really pretty cocoa mocha version, which is really pretty because it goes well with black and brown. But I love that this is like an all black version with that little wooden heel. You guys, these are so incredibly comfortable. Leggings, this is what you're wearing. Skinny jeans, this is what you're wearing. Straight leg, this is what you're wearing. If I wanted to take this whole look just a little bit more casual, I could toss on these Sorrel little boots. Again, really easy vibe, but this is a definitely a boot. It doesn't feel clunky. It doesn't feel um, extremely aggressive when you think about a combat boot. It's just a really great in-between hiker um, combat option with this new Sorrel. Okay, question, do those Sorrells have zippers? No, they don't. They just are all up a tie, like a tie. I'm, I'm lost for words already this morning. Happy Monday, everyone, right? Can't even talk. But what I do with my Sorrells is I unlace them and then I just knot the top so I get it kind of loose and then I just slip them on and off, like super, super easy. Um, yes, did you say you're pregnant? I did say I am pregnant. That is some news this Monday morning. So. Um, for all of you who are just hopping on, if you're like, oh, what happened here? You're in a very aggressive tight dress and a baby belly. Yes, that is true, um, which is super fun. So will you be posting a link to all the new arrivals? Yes, we will. And all of it will be posted and everything will be saved on everyeve.com as well. So does the Reese have stretch? 
Yeah, I think all cut, I think the beautiful thing about cut is that they're not tight. They have a lot of stretch through denim, but they're not like that gummy, yummy. Sometimes you almost are like, is this a jegging? Is this a legging? Or are these jeans? These are jeans, but they definitely have some give and some stretch, which feel absolutely awesome. Hands down, cut is like probably one of the best denim we carry for the value of what they are. So typically under hundred dollars, you're just getting these really beautiful washes. The fits are amazing. I say to everyone, if you have room in your cut, I would size down to the size smaller because it will relax and stretch. What do I, I typically wear in the Reese? I have been typically wearing a six and I'm typically a size eight, but that's because after I wear them for a good six to eight hours, these will relax and I don't want them to be too baggy saggy into a boyfriend. I want them to be that slouchy skinny. So I typically size down to a size six and I am a size 29 pre-pregnancy size. So I think that's everything. Sorry. I feel like I'm a hot mess of words on this Monday and I keep losing my beanie. So that's, you know, that's a win too. All right, crew. Well, thank you so much for all the excitement and congrats on our new little one coming. And I hope you all have an amazing week. We'll see you next Monday.